What's good, YouTube? I got a fire point guard build for y'all today. It's gonna be one of the dribble guy type builds. We gonna get right into it though. Just hit that like button, hit that sub button, and hit them post notes. So we gonna go 6-1. You wanna go 162 on the weight. And the wingspan, you gonna put that at 6-7. We're gonna go compact. And off rip, we're gonna hit the dribbling. So ball handle, you wanna put this up to 97. This is what's gonna separate you from a lot of the other six ones, a lot of the point guard builds. Having the Hall of Fame killer combos, having Hall of Fame clan breaker, fire badges, bro. But most importantly, I would say killer combos. I know some people were saying killer combos didn't work and everything, bro. I've been using killer combos since the game came out, bro. <laughs> it's definitely here. So you want to equip that, and you really going to get stuns, I would say, eight times out of ten, bro, for real, for real. Like, if you know what you're doing, you're going to get a stun on every play. Like, you probably got to do two moves, maybe, and anything. You feel me? Like, you can't just hit somebody with a hezzy and think you about to get a stun, bro. But you feel me? Just saw something real quick, and... You feel me? Definitely gonna be able to use that badge. The speed with ball, we gonna put this up to 92. So you actually get in every dribble package in the game, bro. You feel me? Having at least a 92 speed with ball and ball handle. So that's pressure right there. We gonna go 75 on the pass act. So you getting 26 playmaking badges. That's really, I wouldn't say you need no more than that, but of course you definitely could put more on there. If you go. 86 on the pass act, you only getting two more badges, you feel me? So, I don't know, bro. I feel like you, you might want to just add your playmaking badges on. Like, you feel me? Your extra badges from the my career and everything. If you want more playmaking badges, just add them on. But, with this new, uh, yeah, yo, that make it even more fire, bro. <laughs> Not even gonna lie, because with the new core badge patterns, if you go with the double shooter, you feel me? It's already giving you extra shooting badges, so you don't even need to add your extra badges that you get from the career. You don't need to add them on to your shooting because you already could core two badges. So just add them on the playmaking if you need them, though. Only if you need them. So for the shooting, we're going to put this up to 92. You're not losing nothing on your shooting, bro. Go 92, 78. That's giving you 24 shooting badges. Go 76 right here on the free throw. So that's too fire right there, bro. Not even gonna hold you because all of these tier threes, and you actually could equip all the tier threes, bro. That's crazy, bro. <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna show you how to set up, but yeah, being that you on a 6 1, you got all of these in the tier three. You feel me? So they're a little more expensive, but bro, I'm telling you, if you go with that double shooting core badge pattern, this is really gonna go crazy, bro. We're gonna. Like, this is already one of the top builds. <laughs> you feel me? But season three just made this a little more overpowered, bruh. We're going to go 80 right here on the driving dunk. Leave this at 77. Leave that at 52. And yeah, yeah, for a fact, yo, this is fire, bruh. You feel me? Because it dropped you off right there at 16. So you can actually use your limitless takeoff. And you're going you gonna to lose your core for your finishing and anything, too. Like, if you go with the double shooter pattern. So, again, you don't even have to use nothing else. Like, you don't use these in your tier three on a 6 1, bro. Just use limitless takeoff. These bronze badges is not going to help enough, bro. Like, if you, like, if you're not using that uh, double shooter, yeah, if you can core one of these, yeah, that's perfectly fine. Just make sure you got limitless takeoff on. But, bro, you just, like, that bronze post riser or slitter is not going to do that much you feel me unless you get in like tier one or tier two to where it's cheaper but we're gonna go 76 right here on the perimeter defense that's giving you the pick dodger ankle braces workhorse and your steal rate and we're gonna put this at the 79 just so you can actually get steals in the lane bro like you feel me not helpless you get steals on ball you feel me you're not this not a lockdown type build bro y'all y'all know what this is bro like this is gonna go crazy <laughs> you feel me but we're gonna put the vert up. Oh yeah, we lead a vert at 60. Your speed, that stay 82. We're gonna go 87 right here on the acceleration. Strength, you lead at the same. Yeah, all that's good. Yeah, go 96 right here on the uh on the stamina. 
I'm gonna show y'all where they said the badge is at. But this is really a fire build, bro. Like they can't stop you dribbling. Like you too fast. Your your three your bro your green window's too big. <laughs> you feel me? If y'all need jump shots, I got y'all, bro. Just looking at recent uploads. I got a lot of fire jump shot videos out, bro. I'm not even gonna hold you there. All my jump shots get all A pluses. You feel me? For for like the bigger bills and everything, I know it's it's less shots that got uh, all A pluses and everything. So you feel me? Y'all know how like the centers go and everything, bro. But for the guards, for the forwards, I got a lot of fire jump shots for y'all. It's like it's it's crazy, bro. But these are takeovers. We gonna go with a double sharp take. Yo, you really could go with. Oh God, bro. Yo, you get a slash and take on this build, bro. This is crazy. <laughs> Yo, bro. Yeah, hold on. Yeah, we gonna go with the slasher for the second one. It's crazy because you only got an 80 driving dump. And you get a slash and take on this build, bro. This is OP. You got Shades of Darius Garland, Deer, and Fox. We gonna test the badges out real quick. I'm gonna just show y'all with the uh, with the with the shooting badges hitting off. So y'all see these 16? This is you feel me? This is clear, bro. All you need is this. Uh, let me let's take off for your shooting badges. This how it's gonna look, bro. So you wanna put on Hall of Fame Green Machine, Hall of Fame Volume Shooter. That's your 10 right there. Core the Agent Three. Gold blinders, the gold dead eye. All right, so bruh, this is where the fire come in. So since you could core two badges, you're gonna be able to core the limitless range along with that. You feel me? And if you're not like, if you're not using limitless range, it's gonna go even crazier. Cause you feel me? At that point, you're gonna be able to core the blinders too. Then you would have seven badge points left. So if you core agent three and blinders, and you got these seven points refunded, bro. You will be able to put on, yeah, uh, yo, space. Where's where the space creator at, bro? Oh yeah, space creator tier two for the six ones and everything. For yo, bro, like yo, for that six nine I just dropped, space creator is going crazy on that, bro, because you get it in tier one. But on the six one, I probably would upgrade the guard up, clutch shooter. And really, really, yeah, I would say that's probably all you need, bro. Guard up, clutch, shooter. Just don't forget about Space Creator, bro. This is a goaded badge. It's just even more overpowered when you get it in tier one because you get it for so cheap. But I'm going to hit y'all on the next one. Just wanted to show you how to set up real quick. Shout out to 2K for giving us this level 40 reward, bro. <laughs> you feel me? With the, uh, the core badge pattern. But I'm going to hit y'all on the next one. Just hit that like button and hit that sub button.